Have you started feeling as if you have intimacy issues? But how to know whether you really are suffering from intimacy fears or not? If you can no longer go near the person you love or are shy of sharing what you think about sex, perhaps you have intimacy issues. You might avoid physical contact with your partner or feel afraid to express your thoughts. If you feel you have even an iota of intimacy issues, you need to resolve them. But things become tricky when you have intimacy issues but are unaware of them. At last, they result in painful experiences where you cannot do anything. To avoid this, you should know whether you have intimacy issues or not. In this video, we will uncover signs that tell you have intimacy issues. Let's get started. First, let's know what intimacy issues are. When you have intimacy issues, you set limitations and barriers you won't cross no matter what happens. Whether your partner is showing their vulnerabilities or imperfection, you don't want to show yours. You are afraid of opening up and showing your emotional being. This might feel normal, and continuing with intimacy issues won't feel like a problem until they become too big. Your partner will feel you are reserved in intimacy and sexual relation. When this happens, there is little chance the relationship will last longer. You show subtle signs of lacking intimacy, which your partner might pick up. Before we continue further, tell us, are you loving the video? If yes, please like and share the video and subscribe to our channel for more videos about relationships, sexual advice, and intimacy. Let's continue now. Now, let's know the signs telling you, you are having intimacy issues. Number 1. Difficulty Expressing Needs Intimacy issues can take many forms. Sometimes, you might feel you don't deserve the love, affection, and sexual moments you share with your partner. You feel as if you are getting more than you deserve. This is where you start being reserved. You can no longer share your needs. Instead, you expect your partner to know them without you telling them. But partners cannot read minds. When you don't get what you need, the feeling of being unworthy becomes more active. That's where you decide not to express your needs, and the cycle continues. Number 2. Finding Faults in Partner When you have intimacy issues, you try to find excuses for that. The easiest method your subconscious mind chooses is finding fault in your partner. You start nitpicking and being critical of your partner. You are doing this because of intimacy issues, but you don't feel it. You act suspiciously and start to have trust issues. You might even accuse your partner of something they didn't do, which can further worsen things. Therefore, whenever you start to have these thoughts, understand you have intimacy issues instead of accusing your partner. Number 3. Avoiding Physical Contact That's the strongest sign showing intimacy issues. You would feel the urge to avoid whenever your partner tries to have physical contact. Even if your body wanted to engage in physical contact, kiss, hug, and have sex, your mind would not let you have them. Sometimes that can be awkward, and your partner can instantly find out you don't want to have physical contact. Before that happens, try to resolve the intimacy issues by being open. Number 4. You don't care about your partner to avoid rejection. Sometimes, even if you have a strong relationship with someone, you feel a fear of being rejected at any time. Even if the relationship is five years old, you still feel fear. Therefore, you adopt a mechanism where you start not to care. You think that since you don't care, it won't hurt you if the relationship ends. But what you are really doing is unknowingly making your strong relationship weak. You think you are making yourself stronger for the end, but you are becoming the very reason for the end. Number 5. You don't want to own your partner's problems. When you choose a partner to have a relationship with, you accept all their flaws and the liabilities that come with them. You cannot have a person with a body with no problems at all. When you make someone a part of your life, you have to care for their problems. But sometimes, you are just overwhelmed with your own problems. 
You no doubt want your partner, but not their problems. Therefore, instead of owning and resolving their problems, you keep yourself away from them, creating an intimacy gap. You think since you aren't sharing any intimate moments, you aren't responsible for the problems in your partner's life. But in reality, you're leaving your partner alone in their problems. Do you show any of these signs? If yes, take it seriously and accept you have intimacy issues. It's natural, and instead of stressing out about it, you need to think about how you can bring intimacy back and open yourself to your partner. Comment right below in the comment section, do you know a sign we missed that shows one has intimacy issues? If you loved the video, give it a like and subscribe to our channel to watch videos about relationships and sexual life advice. We bring videos you won't get anywhere else. Until the next video, stay tuned.